So you can also maintain separate address books inside of Thunderbird. So to access your address books, you need to go around over here onto the contact section over here on the left hand side, and then you have the address book tab opened up. So now once that is done, you can go around and then click on this button right here, create a new address book. And then you can see that you can add um, a, a card DAV address book, an existing address book right here, LDAB, or um, I can create a new address book right here. So let's just go around and rename this address book to, uh, let's say for example, TutorTube address book right here, just like this. And I'm going to go around and press OK. So once I do that, you can see that this is what you have right here. And you can go around and create a new contact right here. Let's say, for example, I'm going to say TutorTube channel right here, just like this. And then I'm going to go around and say sample to at gmail.com, let's say, for example. So I can go ahead and then add in another email address as well. So let's say, for example, I'm going to go around and say sample3 at gmail.com right here, just like this and then hit the save button. So once I go ahead, you can see that it actually has this particular address book and you can write it out and you can see that it gets mailed to the default email address right here, just like this. You can go ahead and edit out your contact right here or maintain um, more contacts on that particular address book as well. So let's say for example, I'm going to go around and say tutor to right here, just like this. And I'm going to go around and say sample at outlook.com let's say for example click on save and this contact has been saved in the address book as well so that is how you can create new address book and manage it inside of Thunderbird so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe